Something wrong, Captain? No, nothing is wrong. In fact, I was just going to call for you. I'm needed down in engineering. The bridge is yours. Lieutenant Bedrosian, a word, please. Yes, Commander. What can I do for you? Listen, the captain may have been compromised. What? I have every reason to believe he has been bioformed and is now actively working against us. Hold on. This makes no sense. Did Portal do something to you? I'm dead serious. Someone is sabotaging the mission. They planted a Taconian device in engineering. Captain Solano was in engineering while we were on Delphi Ardu 4, and he purposely evaded Dr. Duval's bioscan. He's not Captain Solano anymore. He's a scion. Which would make you captain. So you're saying you're taking command of the ship? Because if you are, that's one hell of a bold move. And you better be absolutely sure you have your facts straight. As first officer, it is my duty and responsibility to protect the interests of the ship and its crew when the captain has been compromised. I get that part. I read the manual. But without proof, you're talking about mutiny. I have Duval's support. We're going to ask the captain to undergo a bioscan. When he refuses, I need you to back me up. I've already sacrificed a lot for this mission. I hope to have a long career, one just like yours. We do this, we could be thrown in the brig, stripped of our rank, or worse. Is it worth risking everything on your hunch? I haven't been a bridge officer for very long. I don't want it to end before it even starts. I don't know what might happen, but if I can, I will protect you. I'll tell them I forced you into cooperation, that it was all my idea. I won't make you take the blame alone. So, my answer is yes. I'm with you no matter what. When do we act? Now. Dr. Duvall is already on the bridge. All right. I'm ready. Now or never. Captain Solano. Commander Rydek, we need to talk about... Doctor? What brings you to the bridge? Just a bit of housekeeping. You owe me a bioscan, Captain. I don't have time for that right now. It will only take a moment. I can't put this off any longer. You can, and you will. All you'll find is that I'm quite reasonably under stress, given the circumstances, and you aren't making it better. I'll find you in sickbay when I'm good and ready. Or, if you're gonna stand in the way of the mission, I can find you in the brig instead. It's merely protocol, Captain. All officers that touch alien soil have to be bioscanned. I know the protocol. 
It's not more important than chasing down these Taconian marauders. Commander Rydek is right, Captain. We all have to follow the rules. What is this? We need you to comply with the scan, Captain. That's enough. Drop this. All of you. I'm giving you a direct order, Commander Rydek. Stand down and go back to your post. Now. Do not make me tell you again. I've been a starship captain since before you were in the Academy. I won't stand for this. I'd follow that order, if you were actually Captain Solano. Well then, there's only one thing left to do. Security to the bridge. Arrest Commander Rydek. Take her to the brig. On what charge? Conspiring with the enemy and mutiny. Get back. Give her a chance to speak. Let's hear what she has to say. That's enough, Lieutenant Petrosian. Step aside or you'll join her in the brig. No. This is not Captain Solano. He's been bioformed. He's a scion. You're out of your mind. She can prove it. He sabotaged our efforts to track Galvin with this. He planted it in engineering while we were down on Delphi Ardu 4. Lies! Perpetrated by the only Takan in our midst, Portal 6-3. He's actively trying to divide us from within. Captain Solano has refused to be bioscanned because he knows it will reveal he's a scion. Take her to the brig or I'll do it myself. Oh! Wait! Stand down! That's an order! What is the meaning of this? Everyone hold until we get answers. This cannot happen on the bridge of a Federation starship. I can prove I'm right if you just give me a chance. If I'm wrong, then I will face the consequences. If you're wrong, there's no coming back from this. I'm going to settle this once and for all. Commander Rydek was right. Captain Solano has been compromised. He's been bioformed into a Takan. As the Chief Medical Officer of the USS Resolute, I am relieving Captain Zachary Solano of command. Take him to the brig. I don't know what I expected, but not this. I can't believe I shot the captain. I... I don't think Starfleet likes it when you do that. If it helps, that wasn't really the captain. I mean, intellectually, sure. I understand that. But he looks and sounds exactly like him. I'm not sure I'll ever get that out of my head.
Set course for the Usonia system. Maximum warp. It's time to face Galvin. Yes, Commander. I'm sorry. Captain. On your command. Engage. Maximum, but with the algorithms compromised, they may not do much. Captain, that other Elidian ship is here. The Zeldi? We're outnumbered. Captain, your orders. Return fire on the Zeldi. Returning fire. No effect. Their shields are holding. The Veskar's warp engines are powering up. Our warp engines are offline. That must have been their goal. They didn't want us to chase the Veskar. According to my readings, they also took the Cartabula with them. They're not breaking off. We have to destroy the Zeldi before it destroys us. With Diaz and Edsalar still over there? They'll need to evacuate. <sighs> Come on. I almost have it. They gotta know we're here. Hurry. You got it? Got it. Diaz to Resolute. We read you, Diaz. This is Ermot. It's good to hear your voice. Is Edsalar... Is she with you? Everyone wants to know. She's right here. She can tell you herself. I'm not dead yet. Very good, Petty Officer. Can you get us out of here? I can't transport you out while the Zeldi's shields are up. Our phaser fire won't even get through. Is there another way off that ship? We'll find a way. Whatever you do, you'll have to be quick about it. Because we can't give you much more time. We can't let him fire on the Zeldi. Understood. Diaz out. We're gonna have to get out of here the old-fashioned way. The Lydian ships have no escape pods. We can leave out that cargo bay we transported to before. But then there's the vacuum of space to contend with. Those freight containers. Maybe we could use those to make an escape pod? Is that even possible? We're gonna make it possible. Unless you have a better idea. Let's go. I've polarized the hull plating. That should allow us to take a few more hits. Enemy phaser impact dissipated. Heading, Captain? Attack pattern Delta. Target ventral power couplings. Hi, Captain. Zeldi, in range. Fire! Zeldi shields down to 82%. We're doing damage, but they're hitting us right back. We'll run out of hull before we penetrate their shields. Perhaps I can be of assistance. I can modify your impulse engines to amplify their meager output and avoid more of their attacks. But I will need full access to your propulsion systems. That goes against dozens of Starfleet regulations. It's not a security risk if the alternative is destruction. To me, it's simple. You can take this beating and hope you can weather it. Or will you put your trust in me? I've left everything behind for you. The least you can do is put your faith in me. It's not about trust. Keep up the fire on the Zeldi. 
Helm, come about for another pass. Coming about. Phaser banks at full. Shields are wearing down. That's good. Not if we're still on here. All right. One of these freight containers should do the trick. Be quick. We need one big enough for all of us to fit inside. Something we can make airtight. Damn it. Not this one. Here we go. Here we go. This'll work. That's great, but it's not airtight yet. No problem. We'll just seal it up. This container is extremely heavy. Even with the containment field open, it won't leave the bay quickly. I'll find something to accelerate our exit. Casualties on decks 12 and 13. Needless loss. Zeldi shield's failing. Great. So we're almost on even footing. Phaser banks are recharging. We have to hit them with photon torpedoes. Target their weapon systems. Take the teeth out of their bite. That could make them run. We'd lose Diaz and Edzelar again. Hit their engines. We've already lost the Veskar. We need to protect ourselves first. Target their propulsion systems. I don't want them going anywhere. Targeting their engines. Whoa. We gotta move it now. These will give us the push we need. Those are... explosives. We'll ride the blast right out of here. All set. I'll set the containment field to deactivate, and then run back. We can detonate by remote. We'll need to seal the doors from inside the container once we do. Before all the air sucks out of the cargo bay. Just a few more moments. Hurry! doing in there? in this ship can't fly Sidron set it to self-destruct please Amenta no oh. it's not her no I know it's not Carter we have to seal the doors don't leave me get this lifeboat off the ship before Sidron blows it all to hell we're going Edzelar to Resolute. I have the away team. Go ahead. We're about to exit. We see the cargo bay containment field is deactivated. Get that tractor beam ready. And you should know, the Zeldi is set to self-destruct. If we do enough damage to the Zeldi first, it'll prevent the self-destruct sequence from completing. We can't wait any longer. We have to fire. Captain, they're almost out of there. We need to act fast. Hold all fire! Get out of there, Petty Officer. Do it now! You heard her. Done! 
Ready? Detonate! Have them on sensors. Tractor beam activating. Locked on and ready to fire. Fire! Tractor beams locked on. We have them. They'll be pulled into the docking bay shortly. There's something else. I tracked a transporter signal to the planetoid moments before the Zeldi detonated. Sidron. There's a Takan structure there. It's the reason they were here. It's the reason we are here. Now. I have to see it for myself. We'll go there together. I had assumed as much. Is this the Takan arsenal Galvin was after? Legend says this region once held the sacred mysteries of the Takan Empire. Our greatest treasure. Our most fearsome technology. I want a full security detail. Westbrook, Bredrosian, you're with me. Mr. Ermont, you have the con. Wait. <clears throat> you're not the first officer anymore. The captain is supposed to stay with the ship. I'm surprised Lieutenant Bedrosian didn't raise that first. I thought Captain Rydeck knew what she was doing. Are you trying to keep me on the sidelines, Commander Westbrook? No. I... Uh, we've already lost a captain today. I don't want to lose another. Then you better be on your game. We'll deal with the first officer vacancy when we return. Until then, Mr. Ermont? Yes, Captain. <laughs> 